Hi everyone, today we're going to be talking about how to add a question to your classwork page in Google Classroom. So first what you want to do is make sure that you're in the correct classroom that you would like to add the question to. Then you're going to go to the top of your screen and click on the classwork tab. Once you're here, you're going to go to the left and click create and then scroll down until you see question and click on that. Now that's going to open up this new screen for you. And again, you have lots of options, just like materials. You can decide to um, ask this question to multiple different classrooms at one time. If you are in a single classroom, you can decide on which students you want. Um, the more students that you have in that classroom, the more you can choose from. So you can individualize it or small group the question. Then um, you're going to type in your question. So I'm going to put in what is seven times six. And then you have this instructions um, area, which is optional. This is a great place to add in more detail. If your question may be confusing or there's multiple parts, um, you can do that here. Again, you don't have to because it's optional. Below that, we have a points area. So um, you can, if you click on it, you can change the amount of points or you can click the ungraded if you would not like it graded. If you want to get back to your points, all you have to do is backspace and put those points back in. Uh, you can add a due date. So maybe I want mine due by Friday next week. Um, I can also put in a time. So if there's a specific time of day that this um, section of uh, your teaching ends, so if this is math and it ends at 11.55, you can put that in. Okay, you can also decide what topic it's going to go under, or you can leave it without a topic. Because it's math, I'm going to put it under my math topic. Now down here is where you have some different options than you did with materials. You can click on this and decide if you want between the short answer option or a multiple choice. Um, with the short answer, students, um, you can toggle on or off, students can reply to each other, and students can edit their answers. So those are two different options. Um, if you want them to be able to, you want to click it so that it shows the color. Um, and if you don't, you can click it and it will move back. Now, if I choose multiple choice, it's going to change those options. So I have um, some options that I can put in. So maybe I want my answers to be 56, uh, 42. And then if I want to add more, all I have to do is click Enter. And then I get more options and I can put in as many as I want. Um, up here, you have that same option again as before with the short answer. Students can see a class summary. Um, so with this, students are able to see the answers of other students. Um, if you don't want them to be able to do that, if you want this to only be for the teacher, you want to toggle that off. Down here, again, same options as materials. You can link things. So if you want a video to be linked to it or a document, all of those are nice options. And then over here on the side, you can click ask to ask it right away or uh, schedule it or save it as a draft. So I'm going to ask it right away. It's going to go through the process and publish it. And there, there you'll see my question is right here, ready to go. I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial on how to add a question to your Google Classroom.